Hello and welcome to Back is This Sims 4 custom content. In this series I show you everything I made for The Sims 4. Within this video my raisable coral reef objects. These can be used for decorating your oceans, custom oceans and aquariums. Let's start by where to find them in game after being placed into your mods folder. To easily find all 5 objects type coral into the search bar. They can also be found in build mode when going to the outdoor section by clicking the tree and after that clicking the rock icon. All of them will have my backy gaming icon in the lower right corner, a text saying that sims will be able to swim over these rocks and the island living expansion pack icon in the upper left corner. This also means that this pack is required for these mods to be visible in your game too. When clicking the color stripes of the first two rocks, two color swatches will appear. The first one is the default color of these rocks, which you will normally see when Sulani is in a healthy state. The second one is the dead version of these rocks. Of course you would normally see them under the water surface, but as the recolors are better visible above the water surface, I will show them to you this way. When clicking the color stripes of the remaining coral reef objects, 8 color swatches will appear. As all recolors are exactly the same for all these objects, I will only show you the recolors of this object right here. For better visibility, I have already raised it out of the ground so the whole object is visible. More info about the raisable thing will follow later in this video. Just as with the former objects, the first one is the default healthy coral version and the second one the dead version. For the third I have added other sea stars to the default healthy recolor as I don't like the sea stars made by Maxis. I have also changed the color spots visible on the rocks to better match the color of the coral. For the remaining 5 recolors I didn't only change the color of the sea stars and colored spots but also the coral itself. Here you see all available recolors for both the floor as well as the wall coral reef versions. Now let's take a look at what this raisable thing means. For all coral reef objects count that after you've placed them and have activated the move objects on sheet, you can use the number 9 key to raise the objects out of the ground. If you want to lower them you can use the 0 key. Having the ability to do this will make it easier to add more variation while decorating. When only using the normal coral reefs, you can make them layered for example, like also can be seen in real life sometimes. Just as with showing the recolors, I am showing these examples above the water surface too for better visibility. As you can see, having multiple different recolors also makes it easier to create different looking coral reefs. Another advantage of these raisable objects is that they can be placed on slopes terrain underwater without parts floating above the ocean floor. The coral reef wall versions can be used as decoration on your aquarium walls. Remember that these also can be raised out of the ground to make not all walls to look the same. Also don't forget that you can make objects larger or smaller using the open and close bracket keys on your keyboard for even more variation. Something you need to keep in mind is that if you want to use these objects on terrain, that your sims will be able to walk straight through all these objects. This is a necessary thing as most of the time these objects will be placed underwater and your sims need to be able to swim or float above them. This counts for pools as well as in oceans. So if you do want to place them on terrain, be sure to block your sims route. This can be done by using rocks or plants like I also did in this example. As you can see, no matter where I tell my sim to go, he will always walk around the object instead of straight through it. In this example I used both wall versions to create a fun way to look into an aquarium. A fence on the outside is needed so my sims do not walk straight through. Combine all these different rocks with each other to create unique looking aquariums or much more interesting ocean floors. To make them even more interesting, my animated sharks, sea turtles and jellyfish should not be missing either. Also my walkthrough grasses are great to add to these scenes as sims will be able to swim over them too. Next time I will release a few more objects that can be used for decorating underwater scenes. So if you don't want to miss those be sure to subscribe. If you like these mods be sure to hit that thumbs up button and leave a comment. If you want to support my ad free videos and mods consider supporting me on Patreon. This way you will also get to know what I'm working on next. For a download link to these coral reefs take a look in the video description. Have fun using them and then hope to see you back soon here on Baki Gaming.